We are celebrating the 10th series of coffee lectures and this is why you should have a cake next to your coffee. Enjoy! Today we will have a look at the updated ordering process in Swiss Covery. First of all, please use ETH Library at Swiss Covery instead of SLSP at Swiss Covery, which makes it easier to find holdings of ETH libraries. There are now three search scopes. Swiss Covery without CDI means searching 450 Swiss libraries. With CDI, which stands for Central Discovery Index, means searching this additional index with articles, chapters, reports, and so on. But this is external data from publishers, so therefore full text may, may not be available. And Swiss Covery Plus means this mentioned index plus libraries from Word Content too. Have a look there if you want to find even more books. But in general, we recommend the first traditional scope, Swiss Covery without CDI. If you have found your book, there's a new logic concerning the order room system, which is working with two windows. The first and upper window shows the libraries possessing the book you were searching for. You have the possibility to loan the book on site at the possessing library. In this case, it's ETH Bibliothek. Or you can request a digitization of a chapter or an article. Picking up on site may also be possible in other libraries, not located at ETH, and you will see this in the lower place of the first window. Um, but if you do not want to pick up the book at the library shown in the first window, you can check the second window for more delivery options. All couriers are free of charge for ETH members. If you choose any ETH library as a pickup location. Um, but be aware, if fees are displayed, you will have to pay them. This is mainly relevant for the digitization request, as the request may be fulfilled by a non-ETH library and then will send you a fine. Um, maybe you're wondering why you cannot choose the library where the document is coming from. This is because the system calculates automatically the best options concerning fees and quick delivery. Also, loan books are not taken into account. We will now have a look live in Swiss Covery, and I will show a few examples how to order books. So you should see a Swiss Curry user interface now. And now I want to learn the book, Citizens of No Place. And as you see here, um, the book is located in ETH Bau Bibliothek at Tonka Bag. And in the first window, Oh, I'm sorry, this is German. I quickly changed to English. So again, the book in ETH Bau Bibliothek. And in the first window, um, you could loan this book directly at ETH Bau, Bau Bibliothek at the Hunger Bag or make a digitization request. But if you want to pick it up at another place, you can scroll down to the second window for any courier. And again here, please check the fees. If you're ETH member, the courier is always free of charge for you if you just choose any ETH library as pickup institution. Um, sometimes it's not possible to click on the request if the window here is not green but gray, then this is because there's no available document via the courier. Um, this whole ordering process is a little bit different if you want to order journals. And by the way, if you go to the start page, there's a specialized journal search down here, which makes it easier to find journals of ETH libraries. And I'm now looking for the journal Archive for Geophysik.
And again, we see here, now this is available at ETH Depository Library at Hunkerberg. And again, we would have the possibility to pick it up on site at the um, processing library. So loan the volume here or make a digitization request for the article. But now I want to order the whole volume to ETH main building. And therefore, I'm checking the second window for the courier options. And as you see, it looks different than before. And this is because the system cannot yet handle journals. So, but nevertheless, you can just click on journal order and then our form will open. And you can say as which pickup location you, you want to pick up the book or you wish, and then we will do the rest for you. So last but not least, a further example. I am now looking for a chapter within the book Strange Chemistry. So I mean the second result. You see this is available at ETH Infocentrum Chemie Biologie, which is also on um, the hunker bag. And for a lot of books, we have also the table of content digitized. And if you want to order an article or a chapter, you could also make a digitization request. And I perhaps want to order, if you do not know any chemistry, this chapter is for you. I go back to the book. And, but as you see here, unfortunately, there's no digitization button next to the loan button here. And that this is because not every library offers digitization. So I will check the second window for more options. Of course, we could order the whole book via the courier system for free, but in the digitization window, I see now that it would cost five francs for the digitization request. And this is in this case, because the digitization the digitization request will be fulfilled by another library than ETH, and therefore there will be a charge for you. Um, if you are a staff of ETH, you could order an article or a chapter which is not available for free via Swiss Cavalry, also via interlibrary loan. And the easiest way for interlibrary loan is to close the detail page, go up to interlibrary loan, and then say other copies. And again, another form is open. You can fill in the form and we will do the rest for you. Remember, this is free of charge for ETH staff, not for ETH students. All right. Um, there are still ongoing developments in Swiss Cavalry to improve the ordering process. And therefore, we are expecting further changes. So, um, if you get stuck, um, please do not hesitate to contact us for any question or feedback. We are always happy to help. Also, here I listed some useful links that may help too. The next week's coffee lecture is about managing research data at ETH and the data stewardship network. So thanks for your attention. And we will now start a short feedback. And please feel free to unmute yourself and to ask any questions. Wishing you a happy afternoon.